everyone, and thanks for tuning back in. Uh, we got some uh, theme boosters, which in the past, theme boosters, I used to open one every single set. Every set that dropped, I would get a the theme boosters. I'd get all five or all six, however many they had at the time. They didn't always do the gold ones. And uh, I'd crack them on the channel. Well, <laughs> after like the, the seventh or eighth one uh, of doing theme boosters, I was like, wow. These are atrocious. Stay away from them. They're bad. I'm boycotting them. And I did for an entire uh, set. Strixhaven. I did not open theme boosters. I, I said for you guys not to go out and get theme boosters. A good reason. Not that I hate the product. Okay. And someone's always going to defend this. And someone's always going to be on the other side of the fence and talk smack about this product. Okay. This product has been bad, okay? That's right, you got to open it from the bottom. Um, it's been so bad. What they need to do, oh my God, don't steal. Bad things will happen to you. You drop these soap and you'll bots it elope. Bad things will happen to that. Um, they need to step it up. There's like a one in maybe seven chance you can get a double rare pack, which is terrible. And they load these with commons and uncommons and one rare or mythic in the back slot. No foils, you know. So I'm like, well, let's see if they've changed the theme boosters at all. Is there anything new about these? And uh, we're also going to see how many myth, uh, how many commons and uh, versus uncommons we get. So let's just go through this. I'm not going to go too crazily slow. We all know you get a bunch of commons on commons. But there are certain cards that, you know, hold a little bit more value. And, and might make it worth your while. No, probably not going to make it worth your while. Um, the interesting thing about this is after that video of me boycotting them, I didn't look for them until today. And today I went out. Um, I, I went to two game stores. Neither had them. So I'm like, all right, I'm not going to just drive everywhere. I started calling places. No one had them. <laughs> Walmart's by me. Stopped putting product of Magic the Gathering on the shelf. This has happened. Does that happen to you guys? Is the Walmart still supplying? Are the suppliers still coming in um, and uh, dropping off Magic the Gathering product and Pokemon or whatever the case may be? Because the two by me, they did not stock shelves with Dungeons and Dragons. Um, the theft is so out of control that... Um, yeah, the, the merchant or whoever comes in and stocks those shelves, they're like, dude, no more, man. We're sick of getting ripped off and losing money. And I don't blame them, you know. But that might mean Walmart MTG cubes are also gone from the area. Hey, Ranger class. This might be different. This might be different. I see a couple things here. We've got Ranger class, D's card. Lost mine of Fendelver and Tomb of Annihilation. Okay, so, and you get the Dungeon of the Mad Mage on the back. So you get all of the dungeons inside of one of these. So far, like I said, these are terrible. You have to have 25 lands to go with these also. Um, that's, uh, that's how you got to do it. Even it says on the back, you got to have 25 lands. So it's like, if you pick this up off of Walmart's shelf, where do you get the lands from? <laughs> well, I guess I have to buy a bundle now. Like, I mean, it's almost like a gimmick if you're brand new to the game and you never touch this. You know, you open it up. You can't even play the game. You can't even play the game. <laughs> Weird, I know. It's crazy. Um, but, uh, yeah, these these just tend to not be worth it, man. Um, that's my that's really my two cents on it. But I have I, I think the interesting thing about the whole... Uh, local game store is not carrying the product. And the one game store is like, hey, do you want me to get some? And I'm like, no, because I'm going to find this and you're not going to be able to sell them. And, it, and that's how it's going to be. Um, until Wizard steps it up, do not buy these, okay? I might get lucky, okay? I have a feeling we're going to get lucky and pull a Mythic or something like that. whoopity do. There's no way it's going to compensate for the $51 I paid for all these. It was like $7.95 plus tax or something like that. Okay. I actually went to a different game store. I went to the Immortals um, in uh, Rocky. I think it's Rocky River, maybe, the Immortals. So, hey, if you know about that place, there you go. I was in there today. Pretty cool. Um, quiet. Um, it was a quiet bunch. I mean, there was like 10 people up in the, in the store, maybe 12, maybe more. They were all playing Magic, you know. Um, I looked over and, you know, was people having fun. I was like, that's sweet, you know. Hey, two of these Warlock classes. 
and a manticore. But um, they were the only one <laughs> uh, that carried the product, was Immortals. And it's hard to find the place. You would never know it's there unless you, like, look it up online. It's, like, literally in a big office building, like a five, six-story office building, in the basement. You got to take the elevator, go down uh, one, one, one floor to the basement, or the lower level, it's called. Uh, we got Asmodeus, that's cool, and then two dungeons. Um, to, to get there. It's, it's, it's really, really a trip. Uh, if anyone's been there, you know, hey, holla at your boy. It's outside of Cleveland. Um, not far from downtown Cleveland, maybe like a 20 minute drive from downtown Cleveland. But yeah, there you go. There you go. <clears throat> so I'm glad they had them, you know, and I called around and just no one had these. They weren't carrying them. Okay. So at least you could get this inside of these. That's the first one we saw. <laughs> We got one Celestial Unicorn. Man, they, they could have at least jumped the, the pull rate on those, you know. Done something, right? But no. No, no, no. Wizards, no, no. Have you guys purchased these? When was the last time you purchased these? Did you stop purchasing because I said to stop purchasing them? Are you completely new to the channel? And you're eating uh, a McDonald's burger right now. Um, I had actually a McDouble today. I did. It's true. My son, he won't eat them. He won't, he doesn't, he doesn't like the greasy food and I, I commend him for that. He's not even two years old yet. Um, yeah. So that's a good sign though. <laughs> uh, again, I, I got him a happy meal cause I was a kid. I used to love getting happy meals, you know? So I got him a happy meal and it just went nowhere. Hmm. He didn't even want to play with the toy. It was the space jam thing, you know, and you know how LeBron is, you know, Hey, I'm a Cleveland, Cleveland diehard fan, you know, and still I'm like, whatever LeBron, you know, whatever. <laughs> <laughs> enough said, enough said, plus two of this, you're not Michael Jordan, bro, you'll never be Michael Jordan, that's all I'm saying, bag of holding, that's right, and also NBA has tanked in freaking views, man, it's bad, oh, we would pull a freaking Grandmaster Flash up in here, I swear, we would pull this guy, we look alike, that's why, he's a, he's a happening looking chap, huh, so we got a Mythic, that's pretty cool, some juice in the packs, I'll take it, we are on to the gold one, Meow. What goldness will we get up inside of here? That's right. Um, please, guys, if you, if you watch these videos, definitely leave a like. Uh, it helps out a lot, you know? It does help a lot. Or else, I'm going to take a skadoosh fist and I'm going to slam it all over your face, you know? You don't want that. You don't want none of that crap, huh? You don't want no piece of that, man. This is the gold one. We're hoping for a gold rush. Can you get foils in here? Did they change it to foils? Can you get... Did you, no, probably not. So this is the gold guy. Okay, what is this? Evolving Wild. Tap, sacrifice Evolving Wild. Search your library for a basic land card. Put on the battlefield. Tap, then shuffle. What? Dude, that is busted. That is a sick fetch. I don't... That's the first time I think they printed this card. First time I've seen it. Oh my god. That's really good. What does it say? Parts of Faroon still churn with the mage of the arrogant Nithras. Mark mage is long dead. Oh, man. That is trippy. That goes in the mythic pile. Holy crap. I, we have a land now. We got a land now to play with the deck. Well, this thing just totally redeemed itself. Unfrickin' believable. Okay. Okay. We're still, we're still going through the golden this year. We need, we really need a big hit, man. Need a big hit. Oh, ask you shall receive, mother lover. Dang, times two, baby. Woo, that's a hot ticket, daddy. Oh, got two of them. What's good? Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. I, I, can't, I couldn't be more excited. Okay, I'm, I'm, sh I'm shaking right now. I'm shaking. I'm shaking. Okay, okay. Oh, my gosh. Okay, we're good. Wow. Two evolving wilds in one pack. You've got to be kidding me. They really, uh, really upped themselves this time. Buy them up. Oh! <laughs> Woo! Mom, we're going to Disney World! Woo! You're a loser! Son of a bitch. Oh, my mom. Three Evolving Wilds, one pack. You can't make this stuff up. That is just insanity, man. Holy crap. 50 shades of gray. Yawn. Zolt. What a pack, guys. Double rare bulk. 
and we got ourselves three evolving wilds. Holy crap. So, inside the gold pack, most fittingly, you can pull an evolving wilds times three. Maybe my pack was just juiced. I don't know. But you guys should check that out, though. Holy crap, baby. Whoa, whoa, oh! Oh my god, crimp freaking nation! Oh, we got a crimp token! You don't see that every day? Oh my god, look at that, guys! We got crimp! We got crimp! This is nuts! Crimp madness. The whole top of that card. And the other dungeon card. Crimpity doo da, crimpity day. The line, uh, the lost mine of Vandelva. Um, it is kind of ripping off on the top there. And that's pretty crazy. Pretty gangster, though. You don't see that every day. And then we got uh, Tome of Annihilation. Crimpy. Cool, man. That crimp right there. Uh, people are, th these are highly sought after, guys. Highly freaking sought after. Legit sauce, man. Got a genie with a weenie. All right. Uh, cool. We got ourselves two crimp cards. That's cool. Not as good as that Evolving Wilds, but nonetheless. Oh, my goodness. All right. Crimp Madness, baby. That's a rare, uh, a rare freaking sight right there. Okay. We are doing Phantasmo. Yes, daddy-o. Yes, daddy-o. Please, may I have another, sir? Wow. I'm glad we cracked these open, man. We pulled crimp cards out of there. Little did they know, we just got ourselves like two $20 bills, y'all. <laughs> Maybe. They, they, might, they might be 10 to 20 bucks. What, what do you guys think those crimp cards are worth that I just pulled? What do you think they're worth? I want, like, leave your, leave your thoughts. I, my guess, if I had to guess, honestly. No, Joey, we want you to lie to us. Damn it. Damn it, Bildo. Um, I'd have to say the crimp cards we just opened right there, the one that's damaged to crap, I mean, that thing's hanging right there. I don't know if anyone's going to want to buy that. Uh, but let's say it wasn't for the sake of argument. This other one's really not crimped that bad, but this one's bad crimp. Uh, it'd be so fitting if it was Tomb of Annihilation on this one. You know, but it's simply not. But, man, it's cool. You know, Dungeon of the Mad Mage and the token on the bed. Okay, okay, not even a token. I'd say, yeah, like 20 bucks each, you know, maybe. Could be more to the right buyer, you know. Who knows? Spy and Aberrant Mind Sorcerer Pixie Guide. True Polymorph. Man, they really put the bulkiest of bulk crap in these, huh? The bulkiest of bulk crap. Down to the red. And then there was a red one. Open in the red box. We're gonna pull some fire out of this red box. Here we go. Jaded Cell Sword. Shell Sword. Not crimped. Aw, puppy. Yeah, boopy. All right. Appreciate you guys. If you've made it this far, I want you to tell me a story. And that story, I want you to tell me. I felt jaded because there was a dragon breathing fire onto me. And I'm like, you red dragon, you're going to burn into the windfall. And it don't matter about your loyalty because I don't care. I'm a barbarian. I'm going to shoot missiles out my ogre's arse. And we're going to find some prisoners along the way because we got a jaded sword. And that barbarian is going to swing again. Unexpectedly, he's going to throw a javelin in here from a goblin who's going to whip it up in the captain's face. No one cares anymore. Show no mercy them swarming goblins because we got crime goblins on our side. And everyone's going to die when the dragon's fire breathes into the weaponry. And you see a pair of your own goblins staring you right in the face. You ain't no veteran no more. You're just a disgrace with your weak-ass weapons and swords. You got nothing more to come at me with your camp. I don't even care. I got a magic missile and shooting pistols. And we're going to get a rap your duel in your ass because we got monsters that are running rust throughout your ogre's hordes. Don't even matter to me because I'm a barbarian no more. Give me a little bit of that armory because here we go because I'm the one that's going to put on that show with the goblin gold. Don't even matter about that javelin here because that motherfucker ain't coming near me. Ooh. I got a hunter. Don't even, don't even make a wish because that little bitch going to take... Okay. Tomb of Annihilation, Lost Mine, Fallon Delver. Okay, got carried away there. We had some fun. Do up, ba -ba -do -do up, start swearing. I used to freestyle back in the day. I don't really make raps out of any of these because I think that's. But um, I, I do like I do I do I do I do I do talk sometimes. But I, yeah, I used to freestyle with my friends back in the day. So that is it, man. What did we pull? What was our, what was our wish? We pulled the wish. Make a wish. If you could make one wish. What would your one wish be? Let me know in the comments. I'm Joey Moss with Bad Boy MTG. Thanks for tuning in today, guys. Now get out of here. Say something nice to someone.
Life is very short. Try to have fun. But you're never going to have luck like this, sucker. Get off me, dog.